Um, why didn't I clean my room again? Should I, should I make my bed? Nah, probably not. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Well, I should probably organize this area today. But that day is not today. I have absolutely no idea what I should wear. Well, let's see. This, no. Socks? What are these socks doing here? What is this? Oh, I forgot. Oh, gosh, why did I put everything on the ground? Huh. Oh, yeah. I should probably start playing. I hope that the traffic lights don't change. with another new video for you guys and this is going to be my cleaning slash organizing my room and some easy steps to get a super organized room very easily so I have previously done some organizing videos for your room my room and you guys seem to really like it so today I'm bringing you guys another organizing your room video so if you haven't already make sure to subscribe it is very easy and you'll get notifications every time I upload a new video because I know you want to yeah I know you want to. And also make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you are excited, if you like organizing, if you clicked on this video for a reason, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And also if you haven't already, follow me on my social media. I will have all the links down below. I'm on Instagram pretty much every day. I upload pretty much every day. It is like one of my favorite social medias ever. Instagram is bae. So yeah, follow me on Instagram. My Instagram is Madeleine. H09. So yeah, that is basically that for this intro. Let's get right into this video. I see you in the night I found you. So before we get started, I have some tips you guys probably should know. So the first thing you guys should know is that it is so hard and so boring to clean without music. You guys need Music. So yeah, um, I made a Spotify list for you guys that is called Summer Vibes, but um, I'll probably change it into something like Fall Vibes maybe when the fall season comes. Right now it's called Summer Vibes, so go ahead and click the link in the description box down below to find that. So the second tip I have for you guys is to get organizational things, because um, if you have a room with a lot, a lot, a lot of things, just like me, I have a lot of things that I probably don't need even. And invest in something that you can organize the things in. So yeah, that is also a great tip for you guys. So I'm gonna show you guys how to easily create one and what types of organizational things you should have or could buy that is not really expensive. And that is basically the tips. Let's get right into the cleaning, organizing, yeah. So studies show that making your bed makes your room like 80% Cleaner. So I'm just going to be starting out with making my bed, making it all nice and neat again. And then after that, I'm going to start out with the second elephant in the room. So I'm going to start out with taking all the clothes that are on top of my dresser out because I'm going to fold them later. And then I'm going to be taking this super inexpensive bin that I got from the dollar store, I believe. It costed like $1. And I'm just going to be putting all my phone kits there. And necessary things that I have on top of my dresser that just needs to be there. And then I'm just going to be organizing all the papers that are on top my dresser because I probably don't need any of those so there was some random things on top of my dresser that didn't belong there so I just took them away and put them somewhere else okay so right here I had a lot of stuff that was just randomly placed so what I did was that I got these two super cute bins for like a dollar and then I made my own bin in my DIY room decor video you can check that out link will be in the description box down below I just put all the things in there and it looks super cute so I made this apple basket a while ago in my DIY room decor video but it had just been bombed with random stuff so I just took the time to get everything out organize it and take everything that I didn't need out and throw it or just put it back in the drawer where it belonged. So I had two of these old paper holders which I just replaced with a new metal one so that it wouldn't get destroyed easily. And then I threw away the papers that I didn't need and suddenly there was a lot more space between my bed and between my Alex drawers. So I just put everything closer together and it looked good. And then I started folding all my jackets and put them in the drawer and the drawers looked actually pretty good. So that's a plus. Then I just put in all the things that were just laying around my room fold them and put them in the drawers because I was too lazy to do that before, but now I did. 
And then I started with the main part of my closet. So what I did was that I put all of my like jumpsuits on this hanger so that I created a lot more space in my closet. And then for those jackets that keep falling off the hangers, I just put them on some jeans hangers and just clipped them on so that they wouldn't fall off. And then I just continued with putting the rest of the hanging clothes in my closet. And then I lastly folded my jeans and my shorts and just put them into the dresser. And then lastly, for the night table, I had some random books laying on there. So I just placed the same paper holder, well, a different one, but the same type, onto my night table. And then just took away all the unnecessary things that was on there. Then I put in this organizer of my baby lips and my hand sanitizers. It looks great on there. And then it was time to organize my drawers, which is always super fun. No, it's not. But yeah, I just organized everything, didn't really put anything away because everything that needed to be there was there. And that is pretty much how I organized and cleaned my room. I hope you guys got some tips, ideas, and some help cleaning your room. Maybe you got inspired to organize your room. Hopefully you did. If your room's looking like a mess right now, take the time you have to go up and organize it if you want to though. You guys know I would never ask to do something you didn't want to do. <laughs> but anyways, that was it for today's video. I hope you liked it. If it did, Give it a thumbs up and share. And I will see you guys in my next video. One eye. Bye.